हेलो फ्रेंड्स नाउ वी विल डिस्कस द पैरामीटर्स ऑफ हाइब्रिड पाय मॉडल इन पैरामीटर्स ऑफ हाइब्रिड पाय मॉडल वी विल टॉक अबाउट द कंडक्टेंसीज ऑफ हाइब्रिड पाय मॉडल फर्स्ट इन हाइब्रिड पाय मॉडल वी टॉक अबाउट द फोर कंडक्टेंसीज वी कैन सी दिस इज रेजिस्टेंस बिटवीन बेस दैट इज दिस टर्मिनल बी डैश व्हिच इज इंटरनल टर्मिनल ऑफ द बीजेटी so uh, the, the resistance between b dash and c that is feedback resistance is r b dash c so conductance associated with this is g b dash c which is feedback conductance so we will talk about the different conductances first that is trans conductance first trans conductance the trans conductance of b j t if you remember the trans conductance of bjt is nothing but that is variation in ic with respect to variation in vb dash e here and that is equal to mathematically uh, you can refer uh, my uh, lectures on bjt parameters of bjt uh, this is equal to ic by vt where ic is dc bias collector current fine and vt is t by 11600 and that is called thermal voltage so you can see here the trans conductance is function of uh, our collector current as well as thermal voltage so gm is directly proportional to collector current and it is inversely proportional to temperature so trans conductance gm reduces with increase in temperature and increases with increase in collector current this is important uh, this topic is purely from engineering services prelims examination it is not for gate it is not for engineering services mains or civil services mains it is purely for engineering services prelims there can be question on it trans conductance increases with collector current and decreases with temperature these are the small type of questions in engineering services prelims fine now let us talk about the second uh, conductance this is trans conductance the second conductance associated with bjt i will be talk, taking one by one that is input conductance what is that input conductance let us see that second conductance i will be talking about is input conductance that input conductance is nothing but gb dash c gb dash e that is conductance of this due to input resistance so conduct input conductance gb dash e is equal to 1 by input resistance rb dash e right and this is given by please remember this expression this is equal to 1 by r pi it can be written in terms of trans conductance as well gb dash e is equal to 1 by r pi and if you remember expression from small signal model r pi is given by gm by beta or that is gm by hfe that is h parameter so so what i find gb dash e is equal to that can be written like hfe by gm and i can write it further hfe into ic multiplied by gm is what we have just written the expression gm is what trans conductance is ic upon vt so ic upon vt so this is the expression of input conductance of bjt fine so what i find is input conductance of bjt is inversely proportional to collector current inversely proportional to collector current and it is directly proportional to temperature why because i have just written vt is 11600 t is temperature in kelvin this is temperature in kelvin so 
my input conductance is directly proportional to temperature it means it increases with increase in temperature and it is inversely proportional to collector current this so this is how the conductance will change uh, there is there is small correction here please uh, this is beta upon gm Th this is a mistake please rectify it this is beta upon gm or hfe upon gm that was mistake please rectify it or i repeat the transconductors r pi is equal to that is beta by gm and this is equal to hfe by gm and we have just written it this is this can be further written like what that is gb dash e equal to oh, gm divided by hfe so you, i have replaced r pi by this so this is your input conductance and that is equal to what ic upon hfe into vt so what i find here is the input conductance is directly proportional to collector current again and it is inversely proportional to the temperature because vt is thermal voltage which is nothing but t upon 11600 so remember this point so the trans conductance is again function of the h parameter the dc bias collector current and thermal voltage fine so this is the second conductance of the hybrid pi model that is gb dash e third conductance of hybrid pi model is nothing but that is that is feedback conductance the conductance between b dash and c or you can say the third conductance is nothing but uh, we call this conductance as feedback conductance feedback feedback conductance let us see that how to find the feedback conductance here the feedback conductance is between b dash and the collector terminal feedback conductance is that is between b dash and collector terminal that is gb dash c here i can write one expression if input terminal is open circuited if input terminal is open circuit hre if you remember it is given by that is hre is what reverse voltage gain hre is what reverse voltage gain that means input voltage in numerator and output voltage in denominator fine with what try to recall h parameter relation we know that input voltage vbe or vb dash is equal to what hie into ib plus hre into vce so when input current base current is zero when this current coming from this side is zero it means when it is open circuited the ratio of vb dash to vc is will be equal to what voltage across this rb dash e divided by what sum of two why because if you see this is the voltage vce voltage across this branch will be for dc it will be this will be considered open so this resistance divided by sum of two will be hre so that is rb dash e plus rb dash c fine so we, by using this relationship we can try to find what by using this relationship we can try to find your trans conductance gb dash c but here rather than writing in detail so uh, we can please see i can write it like this hre into rb dash or uh, you can take minus 1 into rb dash e is equal to h r e into r b dash c that is how we can write so you can write that expression further 
you can expand it h r e uh, this will be 1 minus rather than this this will be 1 minus this fine 1 minus this but reverse voltage gain of this is very small an amplifier why because forward voltage gain of um, common emitter is large so this will be small so you can write you can uh, neglect uh, this in comparison to UT, so R, uh, unity so r b dash e will be equal to h r e into r b dash c so 1 by r b dash c will be equal to what h r e into 1 by r b dash e that is g b dash e into h r e so this gives this is what g b dash c is equal to g b dash e h r e into g b dash e we have just seen few minutes later this is equal to what you can write the expression of g b dash e that is g b dash e uh, we have seen that could be written in terms of what the forward gain that is 1 by r pi this is 1 by r pi and that is equal to the transconductance r pi r pi is what transconductance this is hfe fine i rewrite that we have just seen r pi is what r pi is nothing but B, uh, hfe by gm so if you write it like this so this will be gm upon hfe we have seen that earlier so gm into hfe and this is equal to hre ic upon hfe into vt that is your feedback conductance i am writing this just to let you know that the parameters of hybrid pi model can be written can be obtained in terms of h parameters if you know the small signal parameters of a bjt you can easily determine the parameters of hybrid pi model and vice versa both are convertible reason and this is one objective type question in general services that is why i'm talking about all these parameters it is not important for gate but for engine services prelims examination so uh, that is the only point of discussion here otherwise those who are preparing for gate they can totally skip this topic there is no need of going into uh, depth analysis uh, in depth analysis is not needed but uh, the further analysis is important for gate as well fine this high frequency response is important for gate as well as engine services but this parameter this discussion on these parameters separately is important for engineering services prelims examination third uh, fourth one fourth conductance is what that is your which one that is output conductance output conductance of hybrid pi model and output conductance here is gce and that output conductance gce is equal to 1 by rce which is equal to 1 by r naught and you can write the expression of this directly i will not go for complete analysis that is h naught e minus gm into hre this is the expression of the output conductance of hybrid pi model again what i am saying every parameter is related with trans conductance and h parameters it means if you have the small signal model parameters you can determine the high frequency model parameter of the bjt fine and we are left with what we are left with the input that is base spreading resistance base spreading resistance and that is nothing but r b b dash and r b b dash i can write directly we know what is h i e h i e that is input parameter of bjt is what that is equal to v b upon i b with v c e equal to zero if you short this if you short circuit this your h i e here will be nothing but r b b dash 
प्लस पैरेलल कॉम्बिनेशन ऑफ आर बी डैश ई एंड आर बी डैश सी एंड वी नो आर बी डैश सी इज इन मेगा वेरी लार्ज सो एच आई ई इज अप्रोक्सीमेटली इक्वल टू आर बी बी डैश प्लस आर बी डैश ई फ्रॉम हियर आई कैन राइट द ऑफ वट आई कैन राइट द एक्सप्रेशन ऑफ आर सी ई which is approximately equal to what h i e minus what r b dash e or h i e minus that is r pi r b dash e is what that is r pi it is input resistance of bjp so you can write expression of r pi in terms of h parameters that is h i e minus r pi is what r pi is nothing but h f e upon the transconductance this is how you can write the expression of rce that is r b b dash that is r b b dash that is base spread resistance so base spread resistance can be obtained mathematically and this is of course approximately 100 ohm but i can if you know hi if you know hf if you know gm transconductance of bjp you can easily determine the base spread resistance mathematically you can determine base spread resistance mathematically but you can not measure it directly fine so these are the different parameters of hybrid pi model these are basically conductances of hybrid pi model that is uh, this conductance this conductance this conductance this four conductances input conductance feedback conductance output conductance and trans conductance and last one is the base spread resistance so these are the different parameters of hybrid pi model which is here what is important here what is important to be noted is notice what the hybrid pi model parameters can be determined from the small signal model parameters and vice versa vice versa means Uh, you can determine small signal model parameters from the hybrid pi model parameters so both models are convertible from each other this is what i am trying to say this is one of the t type question in engineering services exam remember it fine and there can be a uh, one more question based on the variations i have given you the variation i have given i have already shown that the different parameters of the Small so high frequency model are dependent upon temperature, the collector current that is biasing current of the BJT. So uh, if if you know these uh, parameters, so you can see the variations in the different trans conductances and base spread resistance of the hybrid pi model. For that, you can refer my text. There is one small table where I. it has been shown that which will increase which will decrease with temperature just on the basis of those formulas what i discussed earlier fine so in uh, my next video we will be talking about the capacitances of bjt in hybrid pi model that will be separate video and again that is important for uh, uh, gate exam as well as engineering services this is uh, purely for engineering services exam so just wait for my next video thank you very much for watching the video